just I do these scales up and down just to get my fingers going to get those muscles, get the blood inside of the muscles. I was taught to warm up like this by spit sticks. The drummer from Fear taught me how to warm up. thing I could say is that, that I, I miss him very much and I love him very much and like Anthony said he'll always be an energy in a band though he might not be an earthly presence anymore his, his uh, influence and energy will always live in the Red Hot Chili Peppers and uh, you know it's more than just a, someone from a band dying it's, it's, a, it's a friend that's gone it means much more than any one band or any you know piece of music or anything like that. In a twisted irony of, of fate he died in, in, in part so that perhaps I could go on living, you know, because I, I learned such an invaluable lesson from his dying that, you know, I didn't have to die. I'm uh, accepting this award on behalf of my brother, Halal Slovak. He will always be missed. Hillel loved his music, family, friends, and his fans. He was much more than a musician. He was also an innovator. We celebrate and honor his legacy and his amazing accomplishments and his life. Thank you very much. And I just want to take a minute um, for Halal Slovak, who was our dear, dear friend, who I never would have started playing bass unless he asked me to. I love you, Halal. You're always my brother. Thank you. And, and nothing could ever compare to the, the low of, of losing Halal Slovak in his prime. You know, we were young men, and we were living hard and, and very unschooled in the ways of life and uh and we lost you know the heart and soul and the architect of the red hot chili peppers at a very young point in time when he was just getting ready to uh you know keep changing the world with his music he left us with something which was a band and, and a love and a desire to to carry on and everything we do he will always be with us forever he's with us right now